Hello, everybody, and welcome back to A Plague Tale Innocence. Don't come here. Why are they doing that? If they think we have brought evil with us, we have to find a way out of here. All right, well, we did part of this, but... Uh, let's push it. Yes. <sighs> It has very, very strange controls. Oh, you have to... okay. It feels like backing up a car out of a driveway for your very first time. You know, when you're learning to drive and someone says, Okay, go ahead and back it out. And you think, yeah, I know how to do that. And you're 14. And you kind of know how to do it. Like, intuitively, right? But maybe it's more like backing up a semi-truck. <laughs> you have to use both analog sticks. Ah, uh, there we go. Cool. Perfect. Good. We can climb onto it now. <laughs> and then up here we have to... The chain doesn't look very strong. But it will make some noise, right? Do you have a better idea? Yeah, it made quite a bit of noise. Help me push. Right. Well, let's pull. Pulling is a little bit easier, actually. I'm assuming we're trying to get out this window here. There we go, just kind of slid into place once we were pretty close. Come, I'll get you up. Uh -huh. Now we have to be ready for anything outside of this window. Probably to run or hide. Well, we got out. So we can leave now, right? If they don't find us again. But... You have your sling. You can protect us. Ah, uh, ish. It's not that easy, Hugo. Right. Oh. If it were like a crossbow, <laughs> she wouldn't be able to load a crossbow. And she wouldn't be able to pull a bow, a normal bow back with enough force to kill a man. Because that would take like a hundred pound draw. And she doesn't look like she could pull a hundred pound draw bow. So... The sling is what we got. And for the most part, it's not going to be able to take out enemies with any finality but that's part of the experience and I'm loving it so far Outsiders! Oh, no. quickly, shit quickly. oh you bitch sell us out we're, we're, we're going we're going up 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 go 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 up oh Amicia you need to go Oh no! I told you. Oh no! <laughs> Where are you going? Don't leave me! Amicia, come here! This side! There you are! I found this, so you can climb up! Oh Hold yes! On. I'll get it to fall! Watch out! What is it? Oh boy. Um... Is he gonna help us? Come on! Come on. Oh shit! We have to like trust him when he's up there, you know. If he runs off, we're screwed. Well I was scared. I'm sorry about the letter. It's my fault. You were right. We need to go home. We can't. Not without Laurentius. Amicia, hide. Well, where the hell are they? Come. We surrounded the area. They were here a few minutes ago. The two of you surrounded the whole area? Get out of here! Call the others and get those alleys blocked. If I catch those brats, I send them back to hell, piece by piece. They won't get out of here alive. Oh shit. Um, should we run? Over there. Move oh no. There's someone here. Oh, we shouldn't have run. <laughs> That's brutal. Conrad lost his mind when he died. 
We have to burn innocent people? Chase kids? Meanwhile, the plague spreads through the village. Alicia, your thing makes too much noise. You're right. Eh? Shit. He's right. It makes way too much noise. Let's throw it. Can we hit it from here? Oh, he didn't give a rat's ass about that. Don't look at us, nothing going on here. Absolutely nothing to worry about. Okay. Alright, well. I could probably hit those from here with a throw. Maybe. Yeah. What's that racket about? You just go check it out, buddy. Oh, he's gonna come back over here, isn't he? Uh, nothing. And for this guy, I don't know. Um, we do have some collectibles. Yeah, maybe we can just distract him with a pot. Like, if we get him to walk over behind this fence, I think we'll be good. Can we get this one without getting caught? Oh, we can't carry it. Okay. We can only carry one at a time. So, let's make it count. Let's get him, like, over on the other side of this thing. I did hear something. I know I did. Oh, you did. Go investigate it now and stay over there for a minute. Don't turn towards us, please. Okay. Oh, no, not again. oh shit! Which way? Uh, I don't know. There's no way out. Oh no! Quickly, please! I'm trying. I'm trying. Oh, get in! Get in! Shut it! I don't hold them for long. Quickly, quickly! They know we're here. Yeah, they know we're here, which is. No, oh stuck. shit! You go, go through there. Yeah, go, 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 go. Right. Can't stay here, guys. Gotta go. Oh, open the... Can you unblock it? Open the door, Hugo. Hurry. Quickly, Hugo, please. Hugo, he's here. Hugo, do something. Uh, he didn't... Oh, shit. Shit. We can't stop, Hugo. We gotta go. Oh man, he's getting tired. A dead end. We're finished. This way. Don't be afraid. Oh, we're not. I mean, I mean, we are, but at this point, we'll take any help we can get. Oh, you're a godsend, lady. The most infected part of the village. Where are they? Listen, we'll tell Conrad we lost them. I'm not staying here. Yeah, it's the infected part of the village, guys. Go away. Shh. You don't want to look around here. Rest now. We're all Perceive. fine here. How are you? They'll never come looking for you here. You're soaking. There are clothes you can change into upstairs. In a chest in the bedroom. Ah, uh, are you sure? Thank you. So this house has been marked for the plague, I guess. She looks okay. And the elderly and the young would probably be more susceptible, I would think, to the plague, or any illness. Workbench. Uh, so she seems to be doing okay for herself, whoever this lady is. And she's helping us, so we owe her huge. I don't know if we'll be able to repay it, but we're going to try. They're closed for us upstairs. That's better. What about you? We have to oh, go nice. find Mommy Amicia. Uh, not yet. She told us to find Laurentius. But that's silly. We're going to get caught. Hugo, we're going to do what she told us and that's it. Hugo, wait. Oh boy. He's not, like, going to run off, is he? No, he'll, she'll probably, the old lady will probably stop him from running outside. Incense. The same as Mother used to use. Hmm. 
Why are we picking that up? They fit you. Good. They belonged to my grandchildren. Oh, my, my name is Claire V. I'm Amicia, and this is Hugo. Say thank you, Hugo. Thank you. Clervy, what is happening here? The... the plague. So many people dead. And those still alive have... But where are your parents? At home. They're waiting for us. We're looking for a doctor. Laurentius. Does he think that? A doctor. Perhaps... A, a man did come and help at the hospice early on. The monks might be able to tell you more, but... What? They haven't been seen recently. No one goes near the church anymore. It's all we have. We must go and see. You'll die there. But no one listens to old Clary anymore, so... Anyway, I see you have a sling. You're going to need it. But it'll be no use to you in that state. Hmm. Go to the backyard. You'll find some new strips of leather there. And feel free to use the workshop in the next room for your repairs. That's very kind of you. Well, maybe Claire V was a slinger herself back in the day. She seems to know quite a bit. Feel free to use the tools by the workshop. Uh, okay. Right, got the tools. I just need the leather. All right, the leather. It's convenient that they have their own little walled in yard. I like that. Leather. Right, let's get to work. Okay, we'll get to work. Is there anything else out here we could take or take note of? This, uh, this hole is probably going to come into play, I would think. Like, maybe when we have to flee here, the gate will be locked, but the hole will be something we can send Hugo through, maybe. Nothing else for us to pick up. Alright, let's see what we can do. Keep calm and concentrate. Let's see. Hitting enemies in the head kills them instantly. While repairing her sling, Amicia takes the opportunity to change some of the material. This improves the speed of her projectiles, making headshots lethal. So, when I tried to hit that guy before, I was right. We couldn't do that yet. It wasn't because we weren't strong enough. It's because our sling was not strong enough. So let's go ahead. Now that we have the materials, it's highlighting them there. We have the leather and the tools, one and one. And we'll upgrade our sling. That's much better. Oh wow. With the right materials, I could improve it even more. The next one, thanks to special treatment of the rope, Amicia improves her sling's grip, making using it faster and more efficient. And then by branding it with high quality threads, or braiding it rather, Amicia improves the flexibility of the sling and lowers its air friction, reducing noise. So this is going to make it quicker to use. This is going to make it stealthier to shoot from cover, but it's already lethal. Uh, we can upgrade the pouch. We can upgrade the pocket. Doubles the thickness of our materials pocket, making it more robust, so more storage. Oh, look at this. Running and dodging make less noise. By removing the wood from her soles, and wrapping her calves in thick fabric, Amicia drastically reduces the noise she makes. So yeah, most boots would have a wooden insole, as opposed to what we have today, like rubber insoles and vibram insoles and all kinds of cool stuff. Hard to stealth back in the day with wooden insoles in your boots, wooden bottoms to your boots. Uh, let's right. keep all I this in mind. Thank Clovey. You can open the craft menu at any time by pressing... Mm -hmm. But you need a workshop. Okay. So we can check this out whenever we want, but if we don't have a workbench and the materials, we're not going to be able to do anything with it. Ah. Uh, so? <laughs> it's amazing. It's a lot better. 
Thank you, Clevy. Thanks for everything. So that's where you lost them. Oh shit. Yes. Yeah. They won't survive long around here if you ask me. Let's go with that and leave us alone, huh? Just assume we'll die of plague. Oh no, what are you that mallet down? Are you stupid or what? I am not stupid. Don't shout, children. That's enough noise. I want to see mommy. Shut up. You're going to get us killed. For real. Mommy will protect us. That's enough. I want to see mommy. We're going to have to. Dead, Hugo. Yeah. You'll never see her again. Say, so we have to tell him. Poor daddy. Amicia. You, you're lying. They were killed at the house. Both of them. So shut up. You're lying. Lying. I hate you. Oh, no. Don't Please let, stop. Don't Hugo, let him run no. out. Don't let him run out. You go wait. Oh, Don't go shit. out. He's mad. going under the hole. Oh, come on now. Tell me this gate's unlocked. Hugo, come back. Oh shit, he's over here. Oh, this is not good. He's going to get himself caught. What's he doing? Well, you broke him the news in the worst way possible. And I don't know that we're heading the right way. Maybe we need to go back out the front door. Or not. Okay. I'm surprised we can't uh, hop over this thing. All right, well, let's look around and see. At least if we run into any enemies, it might be easier to avoid them without him for now, but. Hugo, please. Oh, come I'm on, boy. Sorry. He's gonna lead us right into the den. Oh my God. Oh Lord. Hugo! All right, what do we got? Five Please rocks. Five rocks. Leave me alone. I'm sorry. Oh God, it's getting gruesome. Oh, here we go. No, 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 no. let him go. So that's where you were. No, wait, we just want to leave. Ah! I, I, d I didn't want to. Amicia! Amicia! I think that's what had to happen. Hugo! I'm, I'm coming! Where is this kid? Did he run all the way up here? Let go of me! Uh, oh, not let another. Go of me. Stop! Uh, We're just waiting for your sister. Not good. Amicia! Same trick's not gonna Amicia! work here. Don't hurt him! You're not gonna put child. me in the ah. I'm gonna start with you. Why do you have no, to come please. here? Please! Huh? Why? Don't make me. Uh, ah. Ah. All right. Quick! Please no. I don't want. Let us go. Too late. Get your hands oh, we can do a little dodge. Come on. Bring it. Okay. Wrong way. Jeez. We can sort of dodge. It's not like a full dodge roll even. There's no escape. Sooner or later. Let's just take this slow. Come on, Conrad. Show him what you do best. I know what you like. 
Fine. I can use that to my advantage. I'm going to show. Um, I'm not sure. Just a bit rusty. There's no escape. Sooner or later. I'm not scared of dying, you know. You took away from me the only Oh thing shit! I no! Don't make me do this, please! Amicia! Amicia! Let's get this over with. Ah, yes. Take me to my son. Do it. Finish me. You kill me! Um, guys, we got a huge problem. Huge problem being I need to pick up a rock. Where is this guy? Oh! Ho oh, oh. ho! Is he not dead? Holy shit. He was coming right at us. Well, it's a good thing we got that upgrade. Not just him, the other guy too. Uh, you just didn't see that one. That's two in under two minutes we've killed after not killing anybody. Oh. Come on. Yeah, they're coming. We gotta go. They're probably just shocked that we took that guy out. Didn't know what to do. Didn't want to be the next to get a rock in their eye socket. <sighs> Retribution. Look, Amicia. I... I'm coming. Are they not just going to come? Oh, we boarded it up pretty good. There's a ladder. This could be a potential... Be yeah, potential escape route. Exactly what I was thinking, Amicia. Whoa. Hugo, dude, you can't run off anymore, man. Why are there candles? The candles are to show that you're thinking of someone. Oh. Can I light one? If you want to. Don't burn yourself. Thank you. I'm sure he's thinking about his parents. For mommy and daddy. Yeah. Watch over them. Not particularly religious myself, but I can definitely understand how in times like these, it could help people learn how to cope it's with funny. everything going on. The sound here. There's an echo. Hello! Hugo, there might be people here. Right. Oh. Picked up another batch of chemicals, and I think we'll be able to use these for something um, soon. Okay, let's go over here first. Looks like somebody's boarded this way up. A barricade. Well, why have they done that? To stop someone from getting in or, or out. out? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, a necklace. It's a rosary. What's it for? I didn't realize we were putting this stuff into inventory. Let's see. Made from simple materials, these necklaces serve as prayer guides. They are extremely widespread and serve as testimony to the inescapable role of religion in society. Religion promises believers that their souls will be saved, provides hospitals with furniture, and divides the year with landmarks in the shape of pageant, pageantry and celebrations. The church also hunts heretics, condemns the profane, and, in more serious cases, excommunicates them, depriving them of the right to faith and isolating them from the community. What else do we get? Spices, rare and expensive. Spices are not found at all tables. Moreover, the population is convinced of a hierarchy of elements based on their proximity to the divine. Fire precedes air, which is above water, which covers earth. Vegetables, which grow in the least noble of the elements, are meant for the most destitute. 
while birds which fly across the heavens generally end up on the plates of lords. That's interesting, and I did not know that. Handwoven dollies are often decorated with lace and are used primarily to protect tables from hot dishes. This dolly is adorned with the family coat of arms, a traditional pattern for young, well-bred girls when they learn to crochet. As the fear of miasma, associated with the smell of the dead, spreads, hygiene makes great advances along with the development of towns and villages. Rudimentary sewers start to appear and most villages have saunas, public baths, accessible to all. On a daily basis, everyone washes their hands before each meal and soap can be found in even the most modest dwellings. So that's interesting because, yeah, probably prior to the plague and everything, um, cleanliness wasn't a big deal and that's why so many people died of sickness. Things that we easily avoid today just by, you know, washing our hands when we use the bathroom and before we eat. People would literally get sick and die in the Middle Ages. Incense and herbs. Alchemists know it and the people are beginning to suspect it. Evil does not exist only in the bodies of infected people. It also travels around them. People start blaming the air, the stench of which indicates the presence of miasmas and therefore the disease. So to ward off the great evil, the air of contaminated places is purified by burning herbs at the risk of burning down the whole neighborhood. Praying. Can I use it to talk to mommy and daddy? We'll do it together. Oh. Did we, did we succeed in lighting our candle? I got distracted by item descriptions because I think we're gonna get a lot about the background, some history and the world from the item descriptions and not only real history, but maybe some things that are unique to just the the world of a plague tale. So we're definitely going to read the item descriptions. If you guys don't like that kind of thing, you know, I'll just go ahead and skip past it, but I, I'll be reading them as I go. Here we go. Forgive me for the evil I have just committed. I never... Amicia, you're already squeezing me. Sorry. So she is not doing well, obviously. She just had to watch her parents get killed and her entire house get killed. And then she had to take the lives of two people very unexpectedly and very quickly. That fight or flight reflex, you know, we've been gravitating towards fight, flight. Uh, but when it came down to it, uh, she was willing to fight. And that's what it's going to take to survive. Is being able to tell when we should flee, when we should fight, and committing to either. I'm loving the game so far. I hope you guys are having fun with it. I think I'm going to take a little break here, and when we come back, I think we're going right back out into it. So everybody wish me luck. I hope you're having fun if you're playing your own playthroughs. Take care, and we'll see you next time.